Wonderful Frogs, Miss Lingle here for week 23's assignment. Today you are going to need a piece of paper, something to draw with, you can use a pencil, I use a marker so that you can see my lines, and then something to color with. Today I've chosen to use markers, but you can use crowns, colored pencils, or paint if you'd like. Before we get started, we are celebrating Black History Month, the whole month of February. So go check out the video of Alma Woodson Thomas's work, and then come back and do some art inspired by her work with me. I hope you enjoyed learning about Alma Woodson Thomas. We are going to now make our artwork inspired by her work. And she mostly worked in straight lines, either vertically or horizontally or radially. She would start with something in the center and work her way out. So in the center of our paper, we're actually gonna draw <clears throat> a heart because Valentine's Day is also coming up in February. So we're gonna recognize Black History Month and Valentine's Day all in one drawing. Now, if you aren't happy with your heart and you would rather draw a circle, that's fine too. <clears throat> Whatever is easiest for you. Now I'm done with my drawing tools, so I'm gonna close up my marker and set it aside. And I'm gonna pick a few colors that I like to go together. And then I'm going to start over here in this bottom left corner and I'm going to make a broken line all the way up to the top. Now what I found when I was trying this project out is that I liked to make two lines with the same color. So there's the first one. Here's the second one. Before I move on to the next color. I just liked the way it looked better than just the single line by itself. And then I'm going to make a pattern. So I'm going to try to remember which order each of my colors go in and repeat that order until I get all the way across the other side of the page. That one's kind of the same as the other one, so I think I'm going to skip it. Maybe I'll use gray instead. <laughs> now blues are cool colors. So I'm going to use blues on the outside, and then when I'm done, I'm going to use warm colors on the inside. So maybe reds, or oranges, or yellows. <clears throat> Here's what my artwork looks like with all my lines in the background. So I started over on the left, worked my way all the way to the right, going around my heart, and then I colored my heart in. You can color your heart however you'd like. So you could do it one solid color, you could do the stripes, or come up with something totally different. On this one, I wanted to show how you could do the lines vertically, but how you could also do the lines in that radial design that we talked about where they start in the center, so my pink line was first, and then work their way out to the edge. And you would do that on both sides of your paper. Whatever you decide, I can't wait to see. Don't forget to take a picture and submit it for your assignments for your points this week.